Hi there! Once you've installed UiPath Studio on your machine, you most probably want to create your first automation process. So let's create a basic process together to get you started. We'll open Google Chrome, load a certain page, scrape the information from it, and then write it in a notepad window. After launching Studio in the Start Backstage view, click Process to create a new workflow. The new blank process window is displayed. Type a name, pick a location where the files will be stored locally, and add a description that summarizes the purpose of this process. Clicking Create saves your input and opens up your new workflow. In order to view the project's main workflow, click the button with the same name. Click the plus sign in the middle of the screen, or use Ctrl plus Shift plus T to add an activity. Search for Use Application or Browser and hit Enter to add it. Notice how the activity is automatically added inside a sequence. These enable you to seamlessly go from one activity to another and use them as a single block activity. Click Indicate Application to Automate and select the Browser window. In case the page is not already loaded in your browser, you can type its URL in the Browser URL field. Make sure that you include it between quotation marks. Add a Get Text activity in the Do container of the Use Application or Browser activity. Click Indicate in Chrome and click on the text that you want scraped from the web page. Make sure that you select both the target and an anchor before clicking Confirm. Targets need anchors in order to be easily identified when the process runs. Select the entire sequence and create a new variable inside it called getText. Ensure that its type is string and its scope is set to sequence. The purpose of this variable is to store the scraped text. Add it into the Save To field under the getText activity. Now, since this is a variable, it doesn't need to be included between quotation marks. Next, add another Use Application or Browser activity to the end of the project and launch the Notepad application from your machine. Click Indicate Application to Automate and select the Notepad window. Thus, Notepad's file path is detected. Add a Type Into activity in the Do container and then add the Get Text variable into the Type This field. As a final step, save your work from the ribbon or by using Ctrl plus S. You can now click Debug File in the ribbon to execute the project, or use F6 to do so. In case something's wrong, running with debugging will let you know what you need to double-check. When the execution is completed, notice that the scraped text has been typed into the Notepad window. And that's how easy it is to automate with UiPath Studio. Thanks for watching.